All right, today I'm going to be installing the EVC throttle controller into the new MUX. All right, let's get started. So included as a kit is the actual controller, and this is your patch lead. So this goes between your accelerator pedal cable, and just a patch lead in between, and then this little connector hooks back up to him, and that thing gives you control over your throttle. All right, first thing, let's install this. So we just need to disconnect the accelerator pedal and then they do provide some cable ties in the box to help neaten it up. Alright, so let's get under there and uninstall. So underneath here we have the pedal, so of course you have the accelerator pedal, which just drives a little um, mechanism here that comes out on these signal outputs. So on this side is a little depression switch you got to push in. So you push it in and bang, out she comes. Very easy. Um, if you're having trouble, look, there are only one, two, three bolts, and this entire assembly can come out, and it can be just a lot easier if you prefer doing it that way. And then we'll pop open the little fuse box, and then we'll feed around the cable. And I don't know, I'm going to mount it just yet. I feel like a couple of these. Um, maybe here for now. Um, but let's have a bit of play around and see where it best is going to sit. Alright, so I'm just going to put the patch in and then we rig it around the cable. Alright, there we have it. The adapter piece has been put in. Um, clicks on super easy. Um, that one needed a bit more pressure to push down. Just make sure you do feel that audible click to make sure it's secure. You do not want this coming loose while driving, obvious reasons. Alright, so now it's got this cable here. We'll feed up, tuck away all nice. And, um, We'll probably just chuck a cable tie up there as well, just kneading it all up, so it'll catch us with your foot while driving. And then yeah, we'll install the controller. There you have it. So I've mounted it here, just for now, see how you go. Um, vision, eh, not the best from the driver's seat, and it just kind of looks alright, so hopefully I won't have to sit it too much while driving. Um, coffee cup still works, and yeah, it doesn't look too bad there. Um, yeah, maybe we should go with the black one, don't know. I'll say I go. Otherwise, yeah, so. Turn on the accessories. She turns on. And yeah, you can just select eco or ultimate or auto or off. So for the new Max, when you do have it, just make sure you hold down mode three seconds. You show double eights. That's for automatics. If you have a manual, you'll want to have it on um, zero, 0 but MUXs don't come in manuals so don't worry about it and you just push mode and it'll go back to its factory mode and there you have it so yeah have a play for it see you go um, I'm probably going to start off with ultimate setting um, just one two three ish I think people have used three and found it pretty good um, but I'd play around with it I might chuck it on auto as well and just see how that goes um, but again this is my wife's vehicle and mine, so we'll just have to find the happy medium between the both of us. But where it'll really come into its own, I think, is when we finally get four driving sand, and we can actually then sort of try everything, see how it goes, see how it goes with the rough country um, setting, and um, yeah, see how it goes. All right, cheers for watching. Bye.